the Occupy Parliament Day, the activities that occurred um, in terms of occupying Parliament and getting inside. What are some of the areas that I pour? Um, you say, okay, legally this is allowed, this is not allowed. The 25th um, day of June was not a very good day, mm. uh, particularly because that act also gives several fatalities. We have been investigating and we have seen um, some of the youths that uh, overran parliament. We've seen some deaths. You know, that we, have, we have some complaints of some of them are missing. So I would think um, uh, that went beyond the, you know, uh, but, but you know, the reason why it would go beyond is because we are not having leaders coming out to meet these protesters. Because the protesters want to be heard. And they, they want to be assured that their matters are being looked into. You know, like the way the president did, called them out, you know, um, X pace and try to answer their questions and, you know, meet some of their demands. So the, those demands have been met, and therefore, I think um, those that have not been met, the protests should not now go out of their way to, you know, for instance, to go to JKIA or talking about going to State House or even invading police uh, stations. I, I think that way we will be moving now to anarchy, mm -hmm. and that is what we want to to avoid. Because on the one hand, we know the protesters are genuine protesters with genuine uh, concerns mm -hmm. and genuine grievances. But we also know that there are goons, criminals, rooters, who are now also coming to spoil, not only to spoil for the agencies, but also to steal and destroy property. Mm -hmm. So the police have two roles to play here. On the one hand, they have to protect those properties because if they don't, then we will investigate them for police inaction. Mm -hmm. On the other hand, they have to guard the protesters, you know, and to escort them. So it's a delicate balancing act. Okay. Yeah, but it's doable when both sides, mm -hmm. the leadership of the National Police Service and the direction that the IG needs to give even to protesters. Oh. Because, for instance, instead of saying there will not be protests tomorrow, he would be telling the protesters, tomorrow's protest, we expect it to be peaceful and we expect you to help us arrest those goons or point out the goons that will be amongst you. Mm -hmm. Tell your officers not to be, uh, trig not to shoot, not to use life bullets, but to also act responsibly. 